Hello, hello, hello. This is Dr. Bad Vibes. Got some news today, and this is kind of a broader look at news, social media in particular. So, as, that's, as social media has become more and more of a part of our lives, it brings us some good things. Hey, I'm here. I'm on YouTube and Twitch. You know, that's social media. Please like and subscribe. But seriously, it's we've seen the rise of things such as, you know, Facebook's been around a while. YouTube came. Uh, but the newest or the newer of the bunch is TikTok. I don't really understand. I think that's the first one where I'm just like, I don't get it. Or no, Snapchat. When that came out, I'm like, I don't get it. Why, why is this a thing? And then TikTok's not far from that for, for me. I understand it a little bit more. It's like, hey, I, I want YouTube, but I don't have an attention span. <laughs> Anyways, people like to share things and try to get views on most platforms. And I feel like it's more, I don't know, people, it seems like on TikTok, they really want it to get the attention and the, and the views and the likes. Some people go too far. And probably the biggest example that I remember seeing initially on TikTok, maybe you saw this one this a few years back. But it was the mom in the hospital whose baby had RSV, <laughs> and uh, oh, okay, this, this one's making fun of it. I can't, so I can't find the original one because the account owner in question here took down the video. But you get the gist of it. She's got. She's, let's see if I can pause TikTok. See, I don't even know. She's got her baby in the hospital, RSV, low O2 levels. Looks like they've got him hooked up to a cannula. To help him breathe and the mom's dancing some idiot dance in the background for whatever reason clicks it's like hey look at my baby now look at me and how many views can i get the internet just dunked all over this lady so i don't i don't blame them this one's got a little parody at the end play that just since i used their video so she's doing her dumb dance that's totally unironic like on purpose and this one's a parody so she's like haha my husband or boyfriend whatever's choking <laughs> same basic idea so, you know, this this girl, she was shamed off the internet, basically. That's a horrible example of how to use the internet and social media in general. This is the perfect example of not what to do on the internet. <laughs> Exploiting your sick child. You'd think people would see this. It got so large that people would think, oh, that's, that's a bad thing. I, sh I can't be doing that. That's, that's such a bad idea. But I think we found something even better. Uh, Jen actually showed me this one. This was from Twitter. I don't know how old it was or when this actually came out. So I'm not going to play the audio because I'm sure it's some copywritten thing that's going to get me in trouble if I play it like every um, TikTok clip ever. But so, well, let me just play it before we get into it. So this is the, it doesn't have any credit on it, I don't believe, but this is the original uh, clip. So actually, I can't see it. My eyes may be puffy from crying all night. I may hate some of the collateral damage brought on by my husband taking his own self. <laughs> Gotta be careful on YouTube. But this is me refusing to give up. I will not give up. I will keep going. Okay. So, okay. I mean, you know, gotta stay strong. Gotta move on. Um, maybe not dance about it. Maybe not dance like that at all, ever. Definitely not over your uh, deceased husband. <laughs> so, yeah. This lady apparently had a husband that, you know, gave in to some issues of some sort. I don't know. I don't know the backstory. But danced about it. I hope this is fake. I don't know. Um, this just came out yesterday. To my knowledge, it seems to be real. Uh, my first reaction was, "How do you say that you did it without saying you did it?" Case in point. <laughs> well, we've got some. We've got some good comments here. Uh, you know, of course, the uh, this is so. This isn't the the account here, uh, Mary King. This is the Twitter account. This th that reshared it. This does like funny parody things. So they, they shared it. <laughs> Their comment is, I wonder what pushed him over the edge. Yes, I wonder too. <laughs> Some of them are just a little more deadpan. If you're able to do this after your spouse takes themselves out, then you didn't really like them that much. <laughs> you think? Oh yeah, yeah, this is one I like. Yes, we know who the beneficiary was. Commenting isn't possible when you're speechless. <laughs> See why he did it? Oh gosh. Oh, here's a good one. It's not funny. It's just profound <laughs> yeah you don't need to share everything with strangers on the internet you really don't bring shame back please let's bring shame back because people don't have it anymore and it's so scary i hate it 
Uh, and of course, the uh, the most common reply is, yeah, she did it. Oh, I forgot about this one. Somebody, hang on. Wait, let me make this one bigger. There's another terrible example. This one, I uh, can't remember how old this is. It was within the past year. I remember seeing this one. So that's terrible. I'm going to go ahead and hit play because I don't want that on the screen. Dude's suffering. Wife's got the camera in his face. So she's like, I mean, I, I do a little bit, I know a little bit of the backstory on this one. She's like, that sucks. Lost him. I guess I'll exercise. And then she turns it into a commercial for her freaking yoga pants. She launched an activewear line to inspire others to do the same. Inspire other people who lost loved ones to sell yoga pants. Okay. I hate the internet. <laughs> I wish these were fake. I'm pretty sure that one's real. That one, uh, that one definitely got um, dunked on to oblivion. <laughs> so don't do this. Don't use the internet and do this stuff. Really, don't share everything you do. Nobody cares what we're eating. Unless it's funny. Yeah, don't don't take pictures of your food and show it unless it's something hilarious. Like, unless you're doing a hot chip challenge or e eating a bunch of salsa. Maybe maybe if you're on hot ones. <laughs> so yeah, I just want to go through some of the comments here. <laughs> Life insurance just paid out. <laughs> Talk about dancing on his grave. <laughs> insurance. Skeptical cat. <laughs> and then, then there's just so many that say, yeah, she did it. 